Hi Komal, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Good, thanks for agreeing to do 21 questions with Cork and Canvas. Can we get started? Oh yeah, come on. Thank you. How do I pronounce your name and where is it from? My name is Komal, it's not Komal, it's from India. I read that your name means to be tender, sweet and innocent. Does that describe you? Of course, but I can be sassy too. What's one thing you had to bring with you from India to Sydney? My architecture equipment. You're studying to be an architect? Yeah, I'm pursuing architecture. Why did you choose that? Architecture is a mixture of art and technology. Of course I need to learn that. Who is your idol, Komal? Peter Zunther. I love his buildings. It's so calm and relaxed. I love it. When did your love for art start? I didn't even realize I was so small. <laughs> Do you have a favorite painting? Yes, come on, show you. I love water lilies. Look at this. It's, you can reflect yourself in it. Scarlets are beautiful. I love it. I just love water lilies. Do you have a favorite artist? Yeah, I love Picasso. Look at this painting. One of my co worker also painted this for me. This is me from my wedding day in Picasso style. It's so beautiful. Yeah. They say good artists copy and great artists steal. What do you steal? I steal vibes so that I can give positive vibes to customers and they can have fun. Do you have a favorite painting to teach here at Cork and Canvas? Yes. I love Starry Night with a twist. People can be creative with it, they can create your own world, it's amazing. They give a strain to Ron, I love it. I heard you recently got married. What was the favorite part of your wedding? Of course the sipping part, but I love the dancing too. Can you show us a little bit? My dancing moves? Yeah. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I love it. So do you prefer Bollywood or Hollywood? Of course Bollywood. I love Hollywood, it's full of colors, traditions, and energy, I love it. What's one thing you always need on you while you're painting? My apron, of course. I don't want to get messy. <laughs> if you could cook any traditional Indian meal for your co-workers, what would it be and why? It will be biryani, of course. It's a layer of rice, gravy and vegetables. It's so delicious. I'll bring it back for you too. <laughs> Thank you. What are your top three tips for first time painters? Make sure you're having fun and don't put your brushes in your mind, put it here. <laughs> What's one thing you hope guests walk away with after a session with you? A big smile and calmness. I love it. <laughs> What's your guilty pleasure? Two scoops of Nutella. Straight off the spoon, I hope. Absolutely. <laughs> What's your favorite thing about Sydney? The sky. It's so colorful. It changes every day. The texture changes. I love the sky of Sydney. And if you could visit any place in the world, where would it be and why? It will be France. So that I can see this art and history of France. I'll go to France. Uh, and I have a session coming up. Can I wrap it up? Sure. So sorry. One more question. Oh yeah, sure. India's been on my bucket list for years. Where's one place I have to go and why? It will be definitely Himalayas. It's so huge, the weather is amazing, and it's natural, it's amazing. I love Himalayas. Thanks, Kamal. You've been great. I'll catch you soon. Thank you so much. Looking forward to paint with you in our studio, Darling House, Crow's Nest and Melbourne. See you, bye-bye. Bye.